that Sarabjit Singh, who was lodged in Pakistan's court, Lakhpat Jail, died in 2013 after he was attacked with bricks, sharp metal sheets, iron rods and also blades. Amir Sarfaraz, who was considered the dawn of Lahore, was said to be behind the attack on the directions of Pakistan's spy agency, ISI. Now, Amir Sarfaraz was shot dead today by unknown men in Lahore. In fact, in December 2018, a Pakistani court acquitted two prime suspects, both uh, Sarfaraz and Mudassar, in the murder case of Sarabjit Singh, citing lack of evidence against them. The court reportedly announced its verdict after all witnesses turned hostile. And uh, Amir and uh, Mudassar, the Mudassar, two Pakistani uh, death row prisoners, remember, attacked Sarabjit Singh in Lahore's jail in 22. Uh, you know, this particular uh, assassination, killing Sarfaraz has been killed in Lahore is what we're learning. After 2018, when he found relief from the courts, he was roaming free. Uh, you know, life was as normal for him. And we do know what happened to Sarabjit, how he was brutally assassinated within the jail premises back in 2013. What happened today earlier in Lahore? Rishabh. Well, person, Amir Sarfaraz, who was released by a Pakistani court back in December 2018, given that all the, uh, you know, all, everyone who was supposed to uh, dispose in front of court uh, turned hostile. Now, what we're learning that an unknown assailant opened fire uh, on him in the Islampura area of Lahore, and he, after sustaining injuries, he succumbed to them uh, at the spot itself. So, yet another case coming in from Pakistan where an unknown entity, unknown man, has been named after uh, killing someone who has an uh, India connection. Remember, only last week, Guardian had had filed a story where, uh, you know, citing sources within ISI, within the Pakistani uh, authorities and establishment, they had accused India of orchestrating these killings. India had very categorically said, no, not us. This is not our foreign policy. Yet another similar killing, yet another India connection remains to be seen how both India and Pakistan would respond to this. But yes, uh, uh, you know, a closure for family of Sarabjit Singh, definitely. Remember, Sarabjit Singh served around 16 years in Kotlak but jail. Mm. He was accused of spying for India. The family kept saying that this was uh, mm. a case of mistaken identity, and he crossed over to Pakistan by mistake. Okay. But, uh, you know... So one of the accused the of his murder back in 2013, acquitted in 2018, has been killed in broad daylight today in Lahore. You know, these stories more often than not have several layers attached to them. We'll have to unfold them one by one, Rishabh. Many thanks for joining us with the latest though.